So, uh, thanks for being here, and uh, I'm going to present you in uh, five minutes uh, the latest update of uh, one of my projects I'm uh, working on, and it's been presented uh, last year at Haklu. So, uh, the idea in short, uh, it's uh, to provide an alternative to uh, Sysmon, which is uh, developed for uh, Microsoft uh, Windows, um, but this time for Linux, and I want something open source and free. Uh, for uh, achieving, like, uh, f to help uh, incident responders, but also to do some threat hunting or uh, threat detection tasks. So basically, uh, have better visibility on your Linux endpoints. Uh, the main features uh, on this of this project is uh, basically monitoring logs. Uh, it can be several kind of logs, uh, execution of uh, binaries. Uh, loading of share objects, drivers, files return, uh, BPF programs being loaded, and uh, yeah, all those logs come with some, um, let's say, guarantees. Uh, they are built to provide some uh, powerful behavior detection and also allow you to track uh, the process activity, the ancestors, which is uh, very valuable when you're looking for uh, basically uh, understanding what is going on on your system. And uh, last but not least, it's made and designed to work uh, perfectly with uh, Linux container technologies. Um, an update uh, on this project. Uh, last year I didn't have any way to filter the logs. Now uh, there is like a, a, a format that you can use. Uh, it's YAML based and it kind of pretty simple. It looks like Yara rules if uh, some of you guys are uh, used to it. So you can both uh, use these uh, rules to uh, create detection rules or uh, filtering rules uh, for your logs. You can also define some actions to take uh, based on those rules. Uh, the two supported actions for the moment are kill a process or uh, scan the files with uh, Yara rules. Uh, many other stuff uh, since last year. Uh, we can configure the tool uh, to load some IOCs. It's been integrated uh, into uh, MISP, so you can directly query some uh, URL on your MISP server and uh, serve the content uh, compatible with uh, Kunai. Uh, as I said earlier, you can also uh, use it to, uh, to load uh, Yara rules and scan your uh, Linux uh, system. There is an, an integration of the community ID, uh, which is uh, something you can use to correlate what's happening on your system with what is happening on your network. So it might be like great uh, source of information. Um, a side project of this is also a sandbox you can use to uh, run uh, malware uh, samples uh, in a confined environment and eventually retrieve the activity uh, of such sample and then build a detection rule based on what you have extracted. There is also um, an installation um, uh, option now that uh, you can use to install it as a, a system uh, a service on your system. There is a hardened mode and uh, it's been also uh, ported to another arch architecture which is ARM and uh, which uh, can be eventually be used on uh, IoT devices. And yeah, it passes fast. I guess I'm even four minutes, which is great. So uh, if you like the project, you can check it out, uh, start it, use it, uh, and most important, give feedbacks. And uh, yeah, thank you.